Hello everyone and welcome back to Darkstorm Dust Starcraft. Last time we helped Alarak in his first stage of Rakshakir or something. We murdered some guardians from uh, of Malasha, so now he has issued his challenge and is gonna fight Malasha Daybreak. Um and I'm not really sure what we're gonna do. Let's find out. Malash has proven himself to be a dangerous leader. Indeed. That's why my victory shall be the sweetest of ecstasy. Has he defeated many in this rite? Countless. He ascended the chain with brutal wrath, plowing through all who opposed him. It's as if he were blessed by the Dark God. They called him the Blade of Amon. And still he was challenged? It is our way. He defeated each with lingering cruelty. Malash revels in bringing his challengers to the edge of death and tormenting them for a time after. That does not comfort me, Alarak. Comfort is a myth. Given to younglings until they are ready for the trials and pain that is true existence. Leave me. It is time to make preparation. Okay, so this seems like very Sith-ish. It's just... Creepy guy does creepy things to everyone who challenges him. Well, more cancel. Please tell me you have something good to say. This chain of ascension is a despicable practice. It is how the Kalai once thought of the Nerezim's Shadow Walk. There is no comparison. Our society was not founded upon... Their culture is one unyielding hierarchy, servant to master, a constant reinforcement of their bondage to Amon. But they have been lied to, Matriarch. And how could this change if it is all they have ever known? Our people once only knew hatred of one another. Suspicion. Yes. We viewed your practices as barbaric, and you viewed ours as cruel. It is the same with the Tal'Darim, with the destruction of Amon and the revelation of his betrayal. I expect their entire society to seek out who they truly are and what they wish to be. I don't think it's gonna be that easy, Artanis. Let's see what we can do with the Void Rays we got last time! Are now ready for your inspection. Void Ray, focus siege. Use increased damage from longer ranges and continues to attack. Uh, deals bonus damage to armored unit. So, have to do 6 additional damage. Increase the range of Void Ray's prismatic beam as it is out of maximum 3 additional range. That's not so bad. New solar lenses will avoid now the Void Ray's beam to remain focused at longer distances. Or the destroyer. Um, uh, what? That looks so cool. Let's see. Void ray stolen, modified by the Tal'Darim Tal'Darim. Destroyers do not possess a prismatic core. Instead, they use a resonating bloodshot crystal to create an unstable beam that arcs from one target to another. Splits and deals damage to additional nearby targets as it destroys the attack up to a maximum of three additional targets. That is mean. That is just auras. But I would actually prefer the void rays. To be honest. The increase in range, along with everything else, would make these excellent siege units. Pardon me? Oh, and it looks like we only need carriers, and then that's be that. Uh, oh, there's something on robotics. The Tal'Darim Wrathwalker robotics are now online, Hierarch. Wrathwalkers? Uh, what does that do? What the? Charge blast. Attacks a single unit or structure for heavy damage. Can attack while moving. Deals bonus damage to structures. Uh, attacks ground and air units. So it's like a single target colossi. Um, well, that's 
good, I guess. But fire. So a fiery AOE or a single target high down as while walking. Uh, I'll stick with Colossi because then I can get them use a get them to use a good front line and then just have this in the back. Do you have anything to say, Rohana? Amon does not care for the lives of Kronos. Well, Alarak may seem untrustworthy, but I think he lacks the finesse for deceit. You what? How unfortunate that most of the Taldarim are blind to their fate. Well, that's what happens. I will admit I was wrong about the purifiers. It was a great risk you faced, but you have risen above it. Thank you. Preserver, I do not appreciate you staring at me. I have been reliving memories. Your people, the Nerezim, were branded heretics. Yet my eyes do not see the evil the Conclave feared. Our people were separated by ignorance as much as malice. To live together, we must see each other as we truly are. As Protoss. And Robos. Solar Core! Terax, our Hierarch has arrived. Thank you. What will happen to Alarak if he fails? I am merely curious. Warnus has said something about being brought to the brink of death and tormented after. Until. well, he's dead. So. excruciating horror and pain, I guess. Terax, the Keystone, it's reacting to void energies upon the planet's surface, most likely. I've seen this before on Ulnar. This Terrazine must be directly linked to the Void. The Taldarim call it the Breath of Creation. They believe imbibing it allows them to speak directly to Amon. A far-fetched claim, yet I cannot deny its plausibility. The substance's properties appear to be foreign to our universe. Perhaps this is why it is so holy to them. They seek out planets rich in Terrazine and turn them into temples to their god. Our coming here may be a blessing to us. If the Keystone reacts to Terrazine like it does with Void Energy, I may be able to use it to stress the artifact, determine its limits. Perhaps fate has not abandoned us completely. We must have faith. I prefer results, Hierarch. Amon is powerful in measures that eclipse even the Queen of Blades. There is no room for uncertainty. Well, yeah. The Keystone is resonating to void energies below. We should yeah, investigate this further, Hierarch. So, Terracene we have. And that should be fine. What is it? 20, 30, 35. So I wouldn't have enough for reconstruction beam anyway. Sad. Sad. I could of course go warp organization down, but still, warping cooldowns are 20% faster than original build time. Instead of just having warp amount of SP. I would prefer this. Um definitely. Uh, da, 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 that was all, and let's see what this mission is. The darkness within calls for the blood of Malash. Now is the hour of my ascendance. The Brakshir commence! That was not so, just overthrow Malash. Support Alaric 25 units or more at the same time in the back shear mission? Huh? And it's called Shear Determination. Haha. <laughs> Destroy three trial the Nexus in the Rack Shear mission on normal difficulty. So obliterate things and support Malash. No, wait. Alarak against Malash. Don't support Malash. Seems bad. In order to reach bonus objective, may have to divide your forces. Yes. I figured as much, but pardon me. I think we can we can live with that. So they're fighting above a pit.
Let's see. The right of Rakshir has begun. From this moment, only Alarak and Malash are allowed to engage each other in combat directly. One must overpower the other and reach the pit of sacrifice. There, the victor will stand as the new leader of the Talgarim, and the loser's life will be forfeit. How do you know this? They appear quite evenly matched. This is true. However, from what I have learned, Rakshir allows the champion's supplicants oh. to support them psionically. Our warriors will be able to aid Alara. But likewise, the Talgarim can assist Malash. I will ready our forces. Malash will fight ruthlessly to hold on to his power. We must be prepared to do the same. So it's a push mission. Interesting. More race. The Talgarim will send warriors to aid Malash shortly. We should ensure Alarak has sufficient reinforcements. So that's why it is I need 25. Malash is drawing power from the Talgarim. Alarak will need the support of our warriors. I am here. Why is Shirtips there? Yes, your psionic power courses through me. Move forward, slaves. Kill all who aid Malash. You would do well to remember that I command these warriors, Alarak, not you. Oh, someone else is over there supporting him. Hi! And that should be dead. And that's dying. So... Yeah, so let's just push him a bit back. Um. You have not oh, brilliant. It would be wise for us to build a second nexus here. Really? So... Well, I guess I can... Do that for a while. Oh, what's that? Hierarch, I don't understand how this is possible, but my scanners are detecting high solarite concentrations in the native beasts here. We ought to pursue them. However, I think it's best if we don't inform Alarak of this little diversion. Understood, Hierarch. What now? Oh, this is... Yeah, that's probably right. That seems like a good place. Oh, this is just perfectly defensible. Defensible, isn't it? I don't think they're not being pushed back yet. We'll do this mostly with ground troops, I guess. You have not enough minerals. Systems Wait, what am I shooting over here? Oh, that is not a good. What? I'm definitely gonna need more. Um. Ring ring and ring. Yes. 
seems like such an easy defensible place. I'll stay here. Just for now. You will go. Yes. Um, I need a forge here. I want this. two stargates. Uh, really? <sighs> so I just have to keep up. This might take a while actually. Oh, hello. Matched. So, hello. Oh. What? A Taldarim attack force is inbound on our nexus point. Brothers, attack the firstborn directly. Where? Cuss. I was shot. I don't see him. So that dies. And then that dies. Right? Dang. So that poor centurion held him at bay. But well done. This vessel mm. shall evade. You require more Vespine gas. Oh. Alarak winning? Goody. So now he's winning. That's not gonna work for long, because I murder everything, murder everything, murder everything in return. Now that you're in a match again, it's not lovely. Uh, oh. I am sensing hybrid. Come to aid Malash. Amon's harbingers, join our struggle. Fight well, warriors, and you will also ascend into hybrid. Oh, you lie with such conviction. It is almost admirable. Hmm. Let's save some money. So, murder that. And murder that. There we go. Channel uh, we need more void race, please. Face crystal. You require more. Really still. Maybe I should have gotten the uh Um, orbital simulators because that would probably have helped a lot. This vessel shall For now, let's go and say hi to the thingy over here. We'll murder that first. You can start already. We have full power. Under Let's see. 
That looks so creepy. So one of us is taking a bit of damage, not much. Should win this easily. Not really sure what those are. Those are. Oh, these are? Those are. Oh, it's actually. What the heck is that? Well, either way. That's a bit weird. Annihilation. Well done, warriors. The first beast has been slain. Fates crystals charge. Prismatic core online. So that's eleven. So we're we'll eleven and ten. Okay, that was not very nice. And. They seem to be coming from over there, so I'll probably have to make a raiding party and go there. But yeah, they also need to charge up there. Uh, you three go here. You go here, because gas is what I'm missing in the ropes. I got one too much. So he's being kept quite even there. We are at full power. Yes, you will go and build some Upgrade cannons complete. here, here, here. Shield battery here, and the big one there. Hybrid again. I sense more hybrid approaching. Be uh, ready. Crying out loud. I'm tempted to just go down and fortify with some cannons. Wait, does anything prevent me from fortifying with cannons? Nothing should prevent me from doing that, right? So why haven't I? Oh look, it's the nasty hybrids. Murder them! This? Murder? They're being some real bastards, aren't they? Now, Dragoon's outrange, the out damage the stalk is anyway. So. Bad. Let's see, we'll have some cannons here. Here, the shield battery there. Then we'll have some cannons here and here. The shield battery there. Oh, brilliant. Shield battery there. We'll have some. What is it? Cannons. Here and here. The shield battery there. And a big one. Here. And here. Doing that should free up my most of my forces here so that I can actually go and take care of the bastards over here. I should be able to do that anyway, but I'd prefer to be able to bring a bigger force than just eight void rays, to be honest. Well. Murder everything, murder that, murder that, definitely murder that. Oh! Warriors, the Taldarim are moving against us from the upper pathway. Prepare our defenses! Really? Taldarim, slaughter the firstborn, and your ascension will be assured. Wait. Oh, that thing is. Why don't. Really? Okay, so you should be done with what we're doing there. We face the enemy. Ah! 
channel the light of Goody. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go. That should help. Uh... Oh, that... That's gotta hurt. I'm not really sure if there are any... Another one? Yes. Kill it, kill it with fire. Or, kill it with purifier. Uh, or something. Is under attack. What? Hyra, a hybrid dominator has appeared. It is on its way to Malash. Locking on to the beast's coordinates. Warping it aboard. Uh, what? So, he's not moving any further because of the towers. And these are going to obliterate this one fast. So, that should be enough to push him back quite a bit. Die! That's a dominator, huh? Dedinator. <laughs> um. So this should actually be enough. Since I'm supporting with at least 25 here, that's 27. That's interesting. Good. So that's 25 units supporting the rush. Hi. We die. You die, you definitely die, you definitely die. You die, you die, you die. So this one has to die. Because it's active. So you attack here and murder everything. Oh, it's just walking back to its position and it's being murdered. Oh, really? Burn it, burn it, burn it. Good. So, why are they... Yes, yes, murder that. Also, can we get another one? There's 23 units here. Um, let's grab some more. So this is actually a useful place for a base. Hi. Do you want to establish a nexus here? Okay. Um, this number here. We go here. Cast our shot. If I only use ranged, I would not be in trouble with. Oh! That's trouble. We'll do this, this, this. And whack! Uh, my poor little friends are not dying. 
but they should outrange everything. Yeah, they outrange them. Definitely outrange. Can I find anything to murder over here? Or use my two minutes in this damn thing. Our confrontation draws to a close, Malash. Soon everyone will know the depth of your treachery. A hybrid behemoth. A what? Be wary, Artemis. A behemoth. This has a name now. Is that something? Um. Okay. Hmm. Yes, thought so. Well, hi. Die everything. Die everything. God fungled me. Slime? No. Let's go and have some fun. So there must be a base. Yes, there's a base over here. So this is a wipeout area that will be cleansed. Not to go in here. Everything's been murdered, that's fine. Didn't expect anything else. Yeah, it's gonna be cleared up in a moment, don't worry. Is this being slaughtered? And. Oh, Tempests? That I that I cannot allow. Mm, what's this? It's like a cool area. I'm pretty sure I was supposed to destroy three Nexuses, and I've only got Nexi. Oh, just murder that one then. Which is fast. It got completely obliterated. Annihilation commenced. Now I have all of them. My preliminary scans indicate that the solarite deposits are a byproduct of the beast's unusual digestive system. Oh, are what you now? Saying that they're... Wait. Never mind. I do not wish to know. No, I want to know. Are you saying they ate solarite? Or that Solarite's... Nah, that would be much more interesting if Solarite was actually the byproduct of which they would get. So whatever they ate caused them to poop Solarite. That is weird. Oh. Can't get one there. And oh, I actually don't. I'll just grab one of the use. <laughs> we need to report it today. We're gonna turn to this afterwards. I did not realize how much we actually needed that. Let's see if I want to close it. Channel the light of iron. Oh, that seems bad. Hierarch, hybrid with great power are on their way to Malash. Yes. That seems bad, right? No? Let's 
murder everything here. Kill them! Kill them all! Preferably fast. Ooh. I'm actually not that worried about... Well, anything. Is already won. You will lead our people to their doom. And you are right about one thing, Malash. I will lead them. We'll just destroy this. And there we go. Whew, that was close. Just in case. Calderim, by the right of Rakshir, I am your High Lord. Listen and obey. Malash promised you lies. There is no ascension. The Taldarim will never be uplifted and become hybrid. Hamon betrayed us. And for this, he must die. They went from directly worshipping Amon as a god to... I did! Didn't I? Ah, I'm pretty sure I did. Anyway, or maybe I didn't actually finish the last one in time. Ugh. Well, guess I'll just have to do that at some point again. Mass a lot of void rays. But oh, that got us thirty soul right. That's good. Let's see if there's a movie for this. That would be lovely. Just a bit. We can hope. I really like the cinematics in StarCraft series. So I'm just hoping there's something cool as a reward. Alarak, the Taldarim have yielded to my authority and the Death Fleet is now under my command. I will use them both to avenge Amon's betrayal. Do your people believe in this cause, as you do? What they believe is of little consequence. What matters is that they obey. You choose to rule differently than I, Alarak. Despite this, we may not only end the violence between our kind, but forge a powerful alliance. Can we now? My people are vastly different than yours, Hierarch. We both desire vengeance, and we are both Protoss. Is that not enough? Oh, very well. Submit to my absolute authority, and we may indeed unite our forces. Not happening. Do not test me, Taldarim. Amon is a mighty foe. Your people cannot hope to stand alone against him. You will side with me, and together we will send him back to the Abyss. <laughs> so you do understand my culture after all. Let us say that for now, we have struck another bargain. Hierarch, hmm. I have powered up a new ship subsystem. You can review it in the Solar Core now. More subsystems are coming online as we speak, and next time I guess we'll be going to the Mobius Core facility where we can acquire some lovely carriers. Because if there's one thing we need, it's carriers. These carriers are awesome. A huge money sink, but awesome anyway. All this time wasted on altruism. If you were Taldarim, your actions would have led to your downfall long ago. Good thing he's not, isn't it then? Well, thank you guys for watching. Um, if you like this video, leave a like. If you have any ideas or comments, leave a comment down below. Hit 
the subscribe button to more for more awesome content and check out the rest of the channel just so you can see what you're subscribing to or if anything piques your taste subscribe because of that and I'm looking forward to next time so yeah I'll just finish it up here I'm Darkstone of the DPS Gamers signing off this episode of Starcraft 2 Legacy of the Void the Taldarim are now ours as well Spear of a Doom Saturn wasted potential your people focused all their effort on surviving some unknown apocalypse when they could have been the apocalypse I'm not sure that's helpful Alrak Either way, I will hopefully see you guys next time. I will try. Hello, Commander. In light of the recent extraterrestrial incursion, this Council of Nations has convened to approve the activation of the XCOM project. You. We are currently observing the immediate behind the keyboard. Thank you for your patience. Seriously, did I miss that? Oh lordy! I'm so stupid.